magical powers like mind controlling or having superpowers alike fictional characters in movies or comics aren't possible in the real world. But genetic engineering could give you something that's more valuable than all these superpowers. Life without death was a thought that started with ancient men. Even the modern world, except its relevance, this could be possible with genetic engineering. The revolutionary invention of CRISPR-Cas9 accelerated its progress. Neuralink, a giant leap in technology connecting our brain with artificial intelligence, by implanting an electrode inside brain will make humans smarter than robots. Both of these inventions are going to change the entire future of mankind. From the beginning of 20th century onward scientific world familiarized basic genetic, engineering like budding in plants, cross-breeding of animals, deriving insulin from animals and so on. Things changed when they started to study bacterias and viruses. They found bacterias and viruses are always enemies. At the ocean, a virus named bacteriophage kills bacterias, 40% of bacteria are killed by this virus alone. The comparatively smaller phage will stick onto bacteria's body and insert its genetic material. Bacteria will be compelled to produce more genetic materials of the phage as it overrules bacteria. Its mode of action is similar to the parasitic zombie fungus which we discussed earlier. Phage will use bacteria for its reproduction. When it's time bacteria will burst out and hundreds of phages will come out killing the bacteria. Evolution blessed bacteria with a defense mechanism. When phage insert its genetic material into bacteria, a gene called CRISPR will find this genetic material and destroy it. Cas9 a special protein of bacteria will take copy of the virus's genetic material and start searching for familiar DNA throughout bacteria's body. Whenever virus injects its genetic material Cas9 will cut its DNA. There are 15 trillion cells in the human body. Each contains a chromosome. DNA lies inside that. The genes inside DNA decides our characteristics like height, color, etc. Half of our DNA is our father's and half is our mother's. Together forms another different DNA that's why we resemble our parents. Small errors inside these genes may cause diseases. They are carried throughout generations. These are called genetic diseases. CRISPR-Cas9 could be used as genetic scissors for to remove the gene that caused disease. Then how is it going to give a life without death? At laboratory, a scientist managed to bring back the eyesight of a rat which lost its vision due to aging. In this experiment he made new cells out of the old one. His name is Shinya Yamanaka and this process is called reprogramming factor or Yamanaka factor. He won 2012's Nobel for his work. We grow by cell division. It stops at the age of 18 to 21. After the age of 40, cells will start to die. And that's the reason behind aging. If cells are regenerated using this factor we could slow down the aging process. Many experiments are going on in this topic. Using CRISPR and this invention drastic changes could be made. We may not be able to prevent death. But we will be able to slow down aging process and lifespan could be increased to 300 years in its initial stage. Even the longest lived human died at the age of 122. Before 2070 this will be possible. Things will accelerate when Neuralink become part of humans. Using this, all information that humans can gather in a lifetime could be stored into brain directly in a millisecond. As the intelligence is increased to 400 times more, humans will become more advanced and more inventions will happen. Even unsolved mysteries of science could be solved in a few seconds. Subjects studied in schools could be downloaded and stored directly to brain we don't have to waste time studying years. Skills could be transferred from one person to another by sending files and many more. Future is developing drastically. Let's hope we will also become part of that future. If you are still thinking that, this is not possible. The smartphone on your hand was told to be not possible before a few decades. 
and many gadgets we use today was a fiction in past. Hope you like this video. This is Broken Brain, we will be back with a mind-blowing content.